Got you that stuff. Oh, great. Thank you. Where's your wife? Mrs. Thornhill, she's mm. not my wife. She's got a husband and two lovely kiddies at home. We met online. It's no nothing sexual. Where is she? Well, she's been trying to throw herself under celebs' wheels. <laughs> well, well, she can throw herself under my wheels anytime. Oh, <laughs> I knew you were funny, Jock. Yeah. I knew. I would like you. C can I have a hug? Okay. Yeah. Uh, uh, hug, yeah. Uh, Come here. Come here. Uh, I've got a protruding hip. It's not a semi. Nigel! Jock! No. You won't believe what's happened! What? Only Al Dinapoli walking. He actually walks! He walks walk among, among us. us! Well, then what are you freaks waiting for? Well, that's a long story. Of mistaken identity. And a lot of lies. Stalking is not what I would call it. Oh, me. I told the judge I thought it was unfair. Yes, anyone's trousers could have come undone at that point. Exactly. Jolly bad luck. And we were such fans. If only we could talk to him. Yes, I know it was only his lawyers and agents. They ruin everything. If we could only get him somewhere private. Is it like that little lockup I know? No problemo. Look, there he is. Oh, shit. It's that crazy English bitch again. Nigel, he remembers me. To the chariot. Jock, you drive. Quick, he's getting away. Come on. Jock, get in. Hurry, we're going to lose him. He's taking a left turn down the high street, Jock. Did you ever imagine we might get a private audience with Al Di Napoli? Only in my wildest dreams. All those nights spent role-playing in Mother's utility room. If only we'd known. Find out! I loved him in The Redeemer. He didn't say kill the poor man. I hear that. Why do you Americans have to shoot at everything? Glad to see you on the proper side of the road, dear boy. <laughs> <laughs>